Good morning, dearly beloved. We thank God for this day too. This is the day that the Lord has made. A day of joy, a day of happiness. Always when you wake up, say to yourself, the Lord is my strength. And this day is going to be a victorious day for me. And so it doesn't matter how you feel, as I always tell you. We don't depend upon our feeling. We depend upon what the Word of God says. Our faith in the Word of God. And so speak it out and it shall come to pass. Shall we go through the Word of God? In the book of Second Chronicles, chapter 20, it happened after that that the people of Moab and people of Ammon and others with them beside the Amorite came to battle against Jehoshaphat. Then some came and told Jehoshaphat, saying, A great multitude is coming against you from beyond the sea, from Syria, and they are in Hazazon, Tama, which is Engadi. And Jehoshaphat feared and set himself to seek the Lord and proclaim a fast throughout all Judah. Praise the name of the Lord. This morning, guess I've, I've been encouraging you. Jehoshaphat was a great king of Israel, Judah. There came a time that the Bible said that the people from Seir, people from the Ammon, the Amorites, and then the Moabs, they all came together. And three great nations, including Syria, they all came together against Jehoshaphat. By that time, I believe you know that the kingdom had been divided. And so Jehoshaphat was ruling Judah. That is only two tribes, Judah and Benjamin. So the ten tribes were not there. It was a small nation, a small people. But three great nations gathered together against them. This morning, what I want you to know is that it doesn't matter how many people, it doesn't matter how great the circumstances of the challenge are. If only you can go to God, there shall be a victory. Amen. In this time, we have already gone the victory, got the victory at the Calvary Cross. But the most important thing is that anytime you are facing challenge, learn to go on your knees and present it to God. Jehoshaphat said, Lord, I can't do it. I fear, but I know that you are able to do it this morning. What do you fear? What is intimidating you? Just surround to God. Be, be, be truthful to God. God, as for this, I can't do it. I fear. The people are many. The troubles are many. The challenges are many. The pain is too much. And so, Lord, I can't do it. I can't face it. Jehoshaphat was so truthful to God. And the Bible says that, there was a victory. This reminds me that the Bible says that if they come by one way, like a flower, the Lord will rise up and stand against them like a flower. This morning, it doesn't matter how many situations that are confronting your life, how many people, how many challenges, how many enemies that are raising up against you. They may come in several ways. But one important thing that I want you to know is Jehoshaphat went to his God. Go to your God this morning. Tell Jesus, I can't face it. I need your strength. And I see victory coming unto you. And I pray, Padudo Bible say, A my hold your case, sorry, dear Jehoshaphat. Now, so I see a radiant dread, dear Mahodna son, Bremu, Nebromo, on your so soon, young Copon Bem, and I pray, near my person is shown, Granny say, and found send your how on the door song, and found send your money who need door song, and found say, we call the way up, Mount Sasso Catcher, Radi say, Radi Mahodna son. Bremu, na osu osu nyanku pon bebe mu, o nyanku pon e ba wonta madem wati. Seni aje ho shafati din kunim e wo dudu ane sorry ti ano no. Saransu na dudu bi a sorry ti awo no osu osu nyanku pon bebe mu e din kunim e wo ni din mu. Isa nse ye su mo nyami a wati asi on se sanda no yo nyami a oyen senche ni nyanku pon. May God cause Himself strong unto you shall we pray we trust you lord that any time that we come to you with all our burdens you are a burden ruler 
and you are you are the one that takes us our pains our sorrows and our difficulties this morning may it be that as your people come before you just as jehoshaphat came before you may there be a victory over their lives against their enemies in Jesus.